by chance, I came across a very touching photo exposition in Amsterdam and the post in Kerk. It's called Bearing Witness. One picture especially had my personal interest because it has everything to do with my mission to raise awareness that we need to make a change away from institutional care towards a family-based care approach so children can grow up in families. This picture captured my heart. It was taken by Howard G. Buffett, a picture of a young boy with legs are chained. This is the description that goes with the picture. Senegal, 2001. This photograph was taken in a compound in a small town in the middle of the desert. There were at least 50 young boys who were in shackles, some chained to trees. They had been sent to these so-called religious schools by families who could no longer afford to feed them. In exchange for their food, board and so-called education, the boys spent all day panhandling in the streets for money to hand over to the school's leader and then chained up in the compound so as not to run away. Conflict is not always as obvious as the presence of weapons. It can be hidden by ideology, greed, politics and in this case religion. This type of conflict creates situations where support structures are undermined, children are exploited and people feel unsafe. Exploitation and oppression of human beings, especially children, undermines the core of a society. Let's make a change away from institutional care towards a family-based care approach. Because what if the family of this boy would have been supported? Then this child would never have ended up in this situation and on this picture in a photo exhibition in Amsterdam.